Right, so, to give a full explanation of what's going on here, and why you clicked on this video if you're watching on YouTube, um, <laughs> this is like the fifth time I've done this intro for the people live on Twitch. Um, the people who have been making the uh, the PC port for CTR are no. trying their best to make the PC port for CTR. A lot of our resources have been um, used for online recently. And um, this is basically an announcement no. video saying that they're going back to um they're going back to making the pc port and trying their best to make the pc port of course online updates are still going to be happening oh, all these bit messages are funny um if you want the good curse luck yeah i've had insanely curse luck today with this but we're finally here and we're finally gonna oh, do it go. yeah what fusion just said jesus christmas all right but um yeah so um yeah, well, we're going to hopefully do a playthrough. Um, I've been told to save state a lot because obviously with it only being 73% complete with um, not Naughty Dog code, like the other 27% is Naughty Dog code, but 73% of it isn't. It's a little bit unstable, but we're going to try. But yeah, we are 27% we are away from having a PC port. Of this game like we are 27 percent of the code away from having a pc port and that is crazy like that's freaking sick um and yeah we're gonna play through this and we're gonna see how it feels basically what exactly is missing so a lot of the things that are missing um a lot of the driving code um is still naughty dog's code so a lot of like this is still naughty dog's code However, um, I, I believe a lot of the graphics now are, um, actually, yes, uh, the graphics, I'm pretty sure, are their own code, but it's nothing to do with Naughty Dog. If you remember a YouTube video a couple of months back, um, when we did this, um, the ground was, like, unbelievably flickery, and, um, water particles, for instance, were not correct, like, the water was glitching in and out and stuff. Um, not anymore. As you can see, uh, the water looks beautiful. Um, as you can see. Um, and here as well. Like, the water looks amazing. Um, so yeah, this is all their own stuff, which is like, pfft, wild. Um, there'll probably be some people that actually have, like, a hand in making this in, like, the comments to this YouTube video, if you're watching this on YouTube, that will be able to give more in-depth analysis as to how much they've done uh, uh, or like oh, what is and isn't Naughty Dog but um yeah this is indeed happening um as I say only 27% away from a PC port being made which is just like wild um just freaking crazy so yeah and uh yeah Basically, yeah, Nate, to give you a summation of what this is, um, this is a 73% original code um, build of CTR. Oh yeah, I'll show the, um, the podium cutscene after this as well. Um, this is a 73% original code version of CTR, which means, basically, basically what this means in the greater scheme of things is we are 27% of the code away from having a PC port. And what this announcement basically is, is saying a lot of the resources for a lot of the guys that were building the PC port and trying to make it happen, a lot of the resources for those guys were spent on online CTR over the last six months or so. Um, and uh, now the online CTR is in a good place with items online and it's very, very stable and collision online and everything. Now a lot more of the resources, a lot more of the resources, excuse me, will be going back towards the PC port being finished. So, um, they're back. Um, so yeah. Is there any way we can support the devs? There is actually, um, I will put a, um, a link in the description of this YouTube video if you're watching this on YouTube and uh, you can support them monetarily that way. There is a PayPal link that I 
um, that I know of that I can I can link in the description and you can you can help them. Um, yeah, for sure. You can absolutely do that. Um, but yeah, I'm going to be doing a playthrough, like semi speedrun, semi showcase of this build um, to show that it is indeed happening. It is indeed taking place. Um, so yeah. But yeah, um, people that are here live, not people watching on YouTube, but I guess also people who are watching on YouTube, feel free to ask questions and I will try my best to answer to the best of my ability. And uh, yeah. Oh, dude, the amount of effects that work is stunning. I mean, Uka, like, spinning into frame and disappearing there when I hit triangle and stuff like that. Even, like, the little things, like, spinning into the portals like this. You know, like, that's all original code now, I believe, which is just, like, crazy. So, that's really cool. Chad, what did I miss? Yeah, so, uh, I'll be explaining this throughout this run and throughout the, uh, the video. Um, yeah, I, I, I'm gonna save state before the Ripperu boss fight. Probably before Sewer Speedway, I'll save state. Um, or not save state, but I'll just save the game, I think. I think I'll just save. Um, um, although, to be fair, if the game crashes, I'll just... I, I can just do, like, time trials and stuff, or I can, like, do door skips to get back to where I should be or whatever. Um, but yeah, to, to give you guys um, basically a rundown, um, this what I'm playing on right now is 73% original code, um, and Naughty Dog is the other 27%, which basically means we're 27% of the way uh, to go until we have a CTR PC port. Um, and uh, this is basically an announcement of the fact that a lot of the resources of the guys working on online were going towards online, and now they're going back towards making the PC port happen. So, um, yeah, hopefully expect to see us hit 75% soon, and then 80%, and then, you know, so on and so forth. How does it feel to control compared to console? It literally feels the exact same, which is perhaps like the biggest compliment I can give it. But then again, again, a lot of like the driving code is still Naughty Dog, so that does make sense. But like, um, one of the big differences between this code is um, all the graphics, I believe, are... Um, all the graphics are um, their own code has nothing to do with Naughty Dog's code. Uh, this loading screen is its own code, by the way. Like, this loading screen is, like, not to do with Naughty Dog. Um, Uka spawning in is not to do with Naughty Dog. Um, everything like that. So, yeah, it's pretty crazy. Also, what's the, um... Just so, just so I know, what's the uh, hotkey for safe staying on Duck Station? I forget... I figure. Let me save. So now I have a save just in case. Failed to save memory card. Yeah, man. I literally saw you save, but that's cool. Ba -na 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 -na. Is Nitro Fuel driving mechanic different from CTR? Oh, for sure. It's it's very, very different. Um, I would say. There's no like speed ghosting or anything like that. Dude, but when the PC port is real freeze, the exclamation mark PC port link is gonna hit like, oh, it's gonna hit like crack, dude. It's gonna hit like crack. <laughs> Where do you plug the memory card into the PC? <laughs> That's so real. So after this, I just remembered, after this I will show off the podium cutscene. Because I keep on forgetting to, because I'm in speedrunner mode. And I keep on forgetting, because I'm dumb and stupid. Uh, yes, the, the PC port will have to be free, because otherwise they will quite literally be breaking the law. <laughs> They'll be profiting off of, you know, even though they made all the code, it, it will technically be, like, you know, someone else's, like, license and 
stuff, so that they, they physically can't charge money for it. Um, like, they can't do that. Um, unless they want Activision on their ass, which I wouldn't recommend, to say. Um, but yeah. Yo, I Duff. Cheers on the five months, man. Thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Appreciate the five months of sub, man. Hope you're doing alright. I hope you're doing well. Hope you are doing Gucci. Yeah, alright. I, I promise I will watch the podium cutscene. I swear. I swear I will do that. That is a thing I will do. Alright, let's let's watch Podium Custom, because again, this is all I believe original code. Uh, I believe this go, specific thing is is original code here. Yeah. And as you can see it works really, really well. And it looks great. And all the animations look great. And it looks great. When I say original code, I mean like originally written by um the people that are making the PC port. Like, it's not vanilla code. Yeah, original is in new. It's brand new code. And it looks great. So, yeah. The cutscenes work. Yeah, that load was instant. Yeah. That load was... Uh, you, you noticed that. Like, it was... There was barely any black screen there. It was just immediate. Effective immediately. Yeah, the, the, don't get it twisted, this is not the PC port. The, this is a decom of all the code. But once it is 100% done, you basically have a PC port. Because you can make CTR run off its own back without any Naughty Dog stuff. So it's like... But once this reaches 100%, it no longer needs to run through Duck Station which is the PS1 emulator I'm using. And then from there, you're, I mean, you're set, you know. From there, you're absolutely set. Uh, it's not that it's copyright salad, it's just that, uh, like, it will be hard to translate it to a PC port because Naughty Dog's code was obviously written for the PS1. So it's like, one of the advantages, if you're wondering, um, like, what the point of a PC port is, and why it's so cool, you, it basically means that we won't be limited to the PS1's limitations. So you will be able to make a track that is a, like, a billion polygons, and as long as your PC can handle it, then great, and obviously modern day PCs are so much more powerful than a PS1, it's not even funny, right? Like, it's not even a question. So, you know, you, you, you got that. Um, and, for instance, you'll be able to make custom tracks, and you won't be limited to a PS1 polygon count for custom tracks. So you can make a track that's a billion, like, you can make fucking Nürburgring in CTR if you want, you know? You can, you can do that, and it'll be great, you know? Um, you'll do that and it'll be great, so let me point the camera more this way. Um, but yeah, you'll do that and it'll be awesome, for instance. Yeah, you, you'll make EO5 in CTR. I mean, that's not a long track, that's just a lot of laps. But yeah, you, fuck it, you could do that. Like, th that's one of the reasons why the PC port is really, really cool. I, I actually asked Nico, who's uh, one of the main guys who has put together a lot of this, what I'm playing right now. Um, I asked him a question uh, a couple months ago, and I said, how many tracks do you think the PC port, when it's completed, could like have on one game without the loading screens being longer than like half a second right so imagine this 
loading screens are half a second long. And you have like a bunch of tracks. Because he said, when I asked that question, he said you could probably have about like 80 tracks, 90 tracks, 100 tracks without the loading screens being longer than half a second. So it's like, damn, you know? All in one game. And of course, what we could do is similarly to the way that Mario Kart Wii is set up, you could like absolutely um, download tracks so that you didn't have all the tracks on one game all at once, but you could like download custom packs onto your game and then like get rid of them after you were done with them and stuff. And you could play these custom packs online, a bit like Mario Kart Wii and stuff. So, yeah, it, like absolutely, that's the thing. So, if you're wondering why the PC port is such a big deal, um, it's all of what I've just said, as well as like custom characters and like, you know, if you can have that many custom tracks, imagine how many like custom characters you can have because they take up way less space. Um, yeah, and what and what Fusion just said as well. Um, which is also very, very important to note. Um, yeah, the, the decomp is not the PC port because it runs through Duck Station, right? Yeah, like that. That's that, that. That's a very, very important distinction to make. It runs through a PlayStation One emulator, but once it's all your own code, you can make it, you know, outside of the PS One's limitations. Yeah, it's very interesting. Also, if you don't think I'm going for Tiziano on a 73% complete build, you're wrong. You're incorrect. So I'm sure this. Yeah, if you comment that exact thing, Fusion, I'll probably like pin it in the YouTube comments. Uh you you, you don't need to necessarily... Eh, no, I, I guess you could pin it in Twitch chat. The, the, the people that get annoyed by the message being, like, long and big can just, like, uh, click the button that deletes the message. But yeah, that's very real. Yeah, that, that's a pretty important note, is that this isn't the PC port, but it is certainly an update on how things are going. Um, it is certainly an update on how things are going. For sure. Alright, uh, surely we hit Tiziano on this build, by the way. Surely we hit Tiziano on this build. Surely, surely, surely. Alright, here we go. Tiziano on the, pool, on the PC board. Mask is in the other... <laughs> Yeah, me getting a mask is in the other 27%, actually. I can see everything normal. The reason why you can see everything normal and the reason why the game isn't absolutely breaking everywhere is because the other 27% is still Naughty Dog code. Oh my god, Engine. Um, it's still Naughty Dog code, so like, there's still enough code there to like... That would have been so funny. That would have been so hilarious. Um... That would have been comedy gold. Um, so, like, it's not like 27% of the code is just missing. Because if that were the case, oh my god, game. Because if that were the case, um, the game would definitely uh, break. But Noi Dog's code is still there and making sure everything works well. This game's easy. It's the easiest game I've ever played in my life. If I hit double, I'm actually him, dude. That's the worst line I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> I mean, I hit a single, though, so that's pretty cool. Yeah, did they code better mask? Oh, gee, hey, I'm down. <laughs> hey, I'm about it. I'm fucking game for that, dude. He was never him. I was never him if he... And I missed the jump input. This is so sad. I blame being on Emulator. That, that that jump input went missing in the in the twenty seven percent of the code that's missing. I promise.
Yeah, sounds good, Fusion. If I hit double, misses rule. Yeah, I just straight up missed the rule entirely. It was really good. And by really good, I mean really, really shit. <laughs> to get around a tight perm. But yeah, all of you can hints work. As you can see, that wasn't the case at one point. I remember there was, um, to, just to show how far they've come, um, with, like, making this possible. Um, just show how far this build has come. I remember the first time I tested out one of these builds, it was a 30% complete build. And, uh, what happened in the 30% complete build, um, is whenever you tried to get an item from the podium, um, the game would completely break, and, um, the load save screen information would come up, instead of Uka's him. So even with, like, take nothing away from, like, the guys who have made this, even with, like, 27% of the code being multi dogs, it's honestly very, very incredible that the game runs this smooth, because it's amazing that there's, like, truly no mistakes in the first 73% of code. Because if that was one mistake, it would break who knows what, you know? Like, it, it could break some. It's as easy as, like, you know, but one typo could break fucking everything, right? So it's, like, it, it's kind of incredible. But their own unique code and Naughty Dog's code mesh so well together, you know? Like that's another thing I want to draw attention to. Yeah, what one typo and Dingo, <laughs> Dingo gets deleted off the face of the earth. So it's like, it's very well done. It also makes you, like, appreciate Naughty Dog more. Because it's like, dude, if Naughty Dog made one fuck up, like... We're, we're lucky that their one fuck up was, like, Penguin Yay 1. <laughs> like... <laughs> The whole game breaks, you know, if one thing goes wrong, so. This cutscene works. Papu need big breakfast, you know? He really do. He's in desperate need of big breakfast at all times. Yeah, it's great. It's terrific. Works wonders. Works absolute wonders, dude. Gaming. Yeah, Papu sure does work here, all right. Sure does work. Spell W-E-R-K. <laughs> E-R-K. Yeah, there we go. I thought I said something else, and I was like, did I fuck up? No, I didn't. Work. <laughs> 360 for the boys? Fuck. <laughs> I just want a 360, dude. Dude, I just want to... I just want to... I just wanna just let me. Thank you. I just wanted to be cool. That's all I wanted to do. I'm a simple man, I don't ask for much in this world. I don't ask for much in this world, you know. Oh, that potion is awful. <laughs> that potion could not have been in a worse spot. Wow. I mean, I'm happy that potion happened here and not, like, in a run on, like, a normal version. Holy. No, we're fine. Chillin'. You were 720 with a turning character? I don't think so. It'd be cool if you could. I, I don't think so. I actually think that kind of turn where you hit square, I think that turn turns the same amount of sharpness no matter what. One of the big fixed 
things here was time trials crashing with characters outside of the main eight cast. You should run time trial with fake crash and see as more taxing on the game. Um, I could do that at the end. Was that one of the like the big problems? Also, how is fake crash more taxing on the game? Or is that a bit? Please tell me that's not real, because if that's real, that's very funny. And I also wonder how on earth that's that's possible. It's those eyebrows? Yeah, it's gotta be. Um, I don't actually know the answer to that, Raz dude. All I know is that like the code that they will be writing will um will translate to a PC port in time. In time. You know, give give it time, but it will. Because the entire point of the decomp is to get to the PC port. It's worth mentioning that this again, like Fusion's pinned message states, this isn't the PC port. But this definitely is related to it in a big way. I still Here's a question then, do the cheat codes work? Here's a question then. Like, can I unlock pen to penguin with cheats? Is if so that what in the ever-loving fuck is that SG? That might be a 21 lap. That might be a 21 lap. Jesus Christ. Okay, Sam. Um, good lord. Oh, my God. Penta mentioned. I mean, he is kind of a go. I want to see if pauses still work. I want to try getting a pause. You know what? N now that I'm going to try getting a pause, let me save my game just in case pauses do anything weird. Because you never know. You never know if pauses are going to do some weird shit. Do you know the pen to cheat off by heart? I don't. I don't. I don't think I know any cheat codes in this game off by heart. Because I'm not a cheat. Because I'm a great guy. Because I'm an awesome guy, great guy. You know? Just an awesome dude. Yeah, Pootis is a gamer. By the way, um, I have like something to say to y'all and to the YouTube audience. Um, Pootis... Um, or Putis Daman, as he is known, um, actually made a, um, a mod for, that can be used on online CTR. So if you want to see online CTR, but with mods, uh, then yeah, I might do that in the future. And by might, I mean I almost certainly will, because that sounds like a fucking hoot. So shout out to Putis. For making dreams come true, dude. I stuck. I don't know why I didn't do the Square X tech. Pootis is just a funny name. Now, Pootis is unironically the man. Like, he is. Like, he really, really is. He is well and truly the man. It's wild. Ooh, hello. What was the announcement on this? To run it by you, um, a lot of the uh, resources of the people who are trying to make the PC port a thing recently have gone into online and making online CTR as good as it can be. Um, and now they're kind of back on making the decomp happen so we can get a PC port sooner rather than later. Um, and I'm just showing off that this build that I'm playing on right now is a 73% um, unique code that they've written up. 
And only 27% of this CTR build that I'm playing right now is actually Naughty Dog. Um, which is incredible. Like, that's unbelievable, really. Um, because I, I... I have played so far, and I, I genuinely can't tell the difference. Like, there's... Like, the, I can't tell the difference between normal emulated CTR and this, so far. Like, this has felt... This has felt identical. Tiny nearly sound. That would have been sad. But yeah, so but they've made online CTR thing, and now online CTR is items and collision, which is just unbelievable. Um, and that's also still like getting updates and still getting work on on it and stuff. But um, yeah, pretty crazy. Can't lie, pretty crazy. Pretty freaking nuts, dude. Uh, surely I hit a boomerang. I, I did hit a single tizzy this run, so... Yeah, dude. Let's go. So, uh, hang on, hang on. Can I just say, I've hit a single tizzy on this build. I've hit a single boomerang on this build. We know what's left now, right? We, we, we know now what I must do. We, we've been knowing. We've been knowing, dude. We have been knowing. Triple TA. Oh, yeah. Heavens no. Oh, I hit... Du okay. I hit single tizzy and I hit double boomerang. So surely it's triple TA. That's just the only logical conclusion. And then I hit four hairpins, which is actually realistic. That part's actually... I, I, I can believe that part. I, I also really want to hit a pause. I can't explain why. I just, I just really want to hit a pause on this build. <laughs> I just really... Fuck. I just really want to hit one, man. It looks cleaner. If you think this looks clean, just wait till the PC port, when we're not uh, restricted to the PS1 polygon count. It's gonna look... Mwah. Mwah. It's gonna look fucking gorgeous. It's gonna look stunning. It's gonna look absolutely stunning. I, I just... Man, I... Every time I think about the PC port of this game, I just get so excited. I get, like, so unbelievably pumped up for it. Like, it's so cool, man. AK NVIDIA graphics pack soon. Oh, yeah. Two words, custom tracks. I think, like, that's the thing. Custom tracks are, like, the thing I'm excited for. Um, without a shadow of a doubt. That's, like... Yes. That's absolutely the thing. Um, just custom content in general, man. I imagine... <laughs> I do it again. No, you go. Oh yeah, voice lines work. That's uh, I haven't like mentioned that, but yeah, they, they've been working this entire time. Uh, all right. Of course, I get good RNG, dude. But well, why the fuck wouldn't I? Can't get good RNG in a normal run. I right, check this shit out. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> that would have been funny. Right? I mean, to be fair, it's funny, but I hit one. To be fair, it's funny, but I even hit one. Like, that's that's amusing. By the way, um, that's another sign. Nitro physics work tremendously well, because that was exactly how that would have happened on vanilla CTR. So that that was, like, 
that was correct as well. Um, yeah, everything about it. Like, it, it's the little things that you don't think about with this build that, like, you gotta appreciate, because it's just like... 73% of the game is not normally well played. I can't even wrap my head around it, like, looking at it. Like, it doesn't even make sense. I'm laughing, Coco. Bring that ass here. Come here. Oh, the AI are good on this section, though. Ugh. Nah, I'm not gonna get it. <laughs> God damn it. I wanted a laugher so bad. Unlucky. You could probably load this version up and do runs on it and most people wouldn't even know us. I don't think they would. To be honest with you. Like, look, look how clean that Komodo Jojo looks, by the way. Look how clean that looks. His nose is the size of Antarctica, but that's fine. Like, it just looks like graphic. It's so good. He seems all zoomed in. That's interesting. Would it help if I did this? I used the far camera. That's interesting. Oh, yeah, that's another thing that works. The far camera. <laughs> that works. That's a thing that functions. You know? Yeah, it, it looks cleaner. I will say. What are we doing? Um, this is a 73% complete um, decomp of CTR. Uh, it's using 27% of Naughty Dog code and the other 73% is all unique code written by um, uh, like Nico and I'm forgetting a bunch of names, but uh, a bunch of people that that was an insane nitro. A um, bunch of people that are trying to make the PC core happen. And, uh, yeah, it's pretty insane. Fuck. It's pretty wild. PS1 graphics are pretty unique, not really rep replicable on PC. It's very... Yeah. Yeah. I, I don't know how to describe it. It's very... Like, there's this I think you're not blocky? I don't know, that's not the right word. But, like, you, you get what I'm saying. You get what I'm saying. You're picking up what I'm putting down. I'm gonna save the game one more time as I go in a hub port. There's a save screen right here, may as well. Just in case game crashes. Although, to be honest, at this point, I'm fairly confident we're not gonna have a game crash. Because this has ran so smooth up to this point. Um, you know? I used to always do this as a kid. I don't know why. <laughs> it was fun. You're picking up one put putting down. That was a reach. I respect it. But yeah, this um, this video, if you're watching this on YouTube or on, and this stream, is basically just an announcement to say that not only is the decomp 73% of the way done, but also that a lot of the resources of people making this were going into online over the last couple months. And now some of them are going back into making this so the PC port will continue getting, uh, getting work done and as we get closer and closer to that, to that moment in history. Um, and it will be a moment in history. Wait, is this the PC port? No, uh, this is the decom. But it's worth mentioning, once the decom reaches 100% completed, 
we will have all our original code to make CTR on the PC. So right now, this is running through DuckStation, which is a PS1 emulator, and it needs it because 27% of the code is still PS1 code, right? Or code that works on a PS1. However, once we're done with 100% of it, we will be able to like make CTR run on pretty much anything because we won't be limited to a PS1 polygon count anymore. So it will be like whatever the fuck you want. Like that, that's my layman's terms. I haven't used a lot of tech terms in describing that, but that's basically what it is. Any funny bugs so far? To be honest with you, no. Like this has ran incredibly well. I was recommended by Nico to save the game like occasionally just in case it crashes, but it has been running amazingly well, which is like, as good an indication that we're in the right direction as anything. Like I, I cannot tell the difference between this and regularly emulated CTR. I really can't. So it's fact that maybe this looks cleaner. Which is a good thing. <laughs> like, maybe. Like, I don't know. It's wild. Think of online CTR as a prototype for the PC port? Kind of. Kind of. Like, not exactly, but kind of. At some point in the future, online CTR will just be integrated into the PC port. So that online CTR doesn't have to run through DuckStation, the PlayStation 1 emulator. And that would be, that's going to be a fucking day. That's going to be the day of all time. That's going to be the day of fucking reckoning when that happens. But yeah, no, no, no bugs so far. Which, again, is like, I and mean, what an achievement. What an achievement, you know? What an incredible achievement to have this run as smooth as, as it is currently. It's crazy, man. Hope for some, for some CTR pre pass it. Well, I am gonna, after this quote unquote run, quote unquote, um, I am gonna do um, a time trial with an unlocked character. And the reason why that's such a big deal is because apparently that was something they were really, really struggling with getting working um, in previous builds. So I'm gonna try and see if it does that or if I'm gonna break the fuck out of the game. Yeah, Fake Crash might st start a creepypasta, maybe. Oh, and if we don't get that, I'll show you some creepypasta shit at the end. Um, just that really, really shows off the fact that this is this build, you know? Um, yeah, uh, uh, yeah, the, the PC port on speedrun.com will be its own game. Because the PC port is going to have like quarter of a second long loading screens, for instance, and like it, it's not even going to be remotely comparable to console. Um, so it's going to need its own home on speedon.com for sure. I missed the announcement. You didn't. We're currently doing the announcement right now, uh, and the announcement is um, that this game uh, that I'm playing right now, this version of CTR, is 73% not Naughty Dog code, um, which means we are 27% of the way from having um, a, you know, being very, very close to the PC port, basically. And what this announcement is, in shorthand, is just um, a lot of the resources of the people that were making this um, went to online over the last couple months. And now, pauses work. And now they are. Um, a lot of them are going back to this. Well, not a lot of them, but like, there is more work being done on this now than there was, like last month, for instance. And people are starting to work on this again, which means we will be close to the PC port sooner, which is obviously amazing, because um, PC port means custom tracks and smooth online and. God knows what else. Um, so, yeah, pretty incredible. Yep, dead. <laughs> uh, frickin' it. 
Wrong way! I stink. Chat, you better pour over Mushroom Peaks. See, here's the thing. I I kind of... Because I was there for a lot of, like, Mario Kart Wii's growth into being the custom track game that it is now. Dude, fucking hell, relax. Um, Because I was there for a lot of it when I was a kid. Um, I feel like... Um, I feel like the first ever custom track that isn't Tile Trauma, obviously, but the first custom track that gets made without any use of code and just purely a custom track editor, the first custom track that ever gets made is going to be like a fucking circle, and then the second one that ever gets made is going to be like Mushroom Peaks. Like, I, I just know for a fact we're going to go from like the most insanely like who cares track of all time, but just to prove that it's possible. And we're gonna immediately jump to like fucking Six King Labyrinth, dude. Yeah, we're gonna go from Dot Dash to fuck you real quick. Yeah, no. Like, that's what we're gonna do. I, I kind of already see the timeline. And I think that it's funny. You know? Ugh. Leaking your current address on a CTR custom track. Oh, dude, that's awesome. Dude, that's so sick. Ugh. Same Cortex, I feel that, man. Was that 3 out of 3 happen? That was 3 out of 3 happen. Like, lap 1 sucked, but that was 3 out of 3 happen. And that is funny. That is hysterical. Three out of three happen on this build. A bit wild. We'll crash one, two, three, and spy tracks would be cool. I think even beyond like the like a track being inspired by a previous game. I think you could straight up make, like, Toad Village in this game. Make make a one lap track of Toad Village and just send it off. How on earth have I not hit any of those AI that I just went through? I hit one of them, but like, after that I hit none. It's wild. Like, there was a line of four AI, and I perfectly threaded the needle. Yeah, I, I want I want Dot Dash as a custom track in this game, but it's a thousand laps. Just because fuck you, you know? Just because, hey, hey, fuck you. Because it'd be funny. Oh, I stink. Oh yeah, let me do the fun backup. Instead of the lame backup. Yeah, and then you get an SG out of it and it's funny. We make all of Crash Bash into CTR. You know, one of the first ever mods of CTR ever was back in like 2018, 2019. And someone made a really, really scuffed looking version of Crash Ball in CTR with CTR stuff. And like, they made the go-karts like the uh, the things that block the balls and stuff. It was very funny looking. But that's on YouTube, you can find that. Um, but it's a very, very early mod. Very early. Uh, we've come a long way since then, that's for sure. Come a long way since then, that's for sure. Yeah, it was in like the super early days. Does the foist cut scene work? Yeah, it does. Best believe it does. 
Me voice. I'm speed champion here. And I'm gonna save the world for a sizable fee, of course. <laughs> He's just like me for real. Only saving the world for a sizable fee, dude. Preach, brother. <laughs> Preach, brother. If I don't get my five gift subs, what's the point in saving the world, you know? What's the point? I feel that. Pinstripe kind of a twink, no? Okay, we've got to start this whole run and recording over because I can't upload this to YouTube now. Uh, we've ruined it. We've ruined it. Completely ruined it. Uh, we've ruined everything. Uh, it's a wrap. GG's. Unlucky. 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 You're mine! Somebody. Pinstripe just said your mum. That's crazy. Say good night. 39 lap one. I'm four for four on happen. You know, not to bring it up, but to bring it up. But like to bring it up, you know? But to be that guy and bring it up. But to absolutely be that fucking guy. No. No. Wrong way. I wear his bombs at. Alright, imagine I get 6 out of 6 hairpin on this build. That's actually funny. Like, if I get 6 out of 6 hairpin, I'm, I'm insane. I don't know what to tell you, but I'm insane. This would be very amusing. <laughs> this game is easy. 6 out of 6 hairpin on 73% build? Dude, that's actually fire. <laughs> I can't lie, that's actually so sick. That's actually fucking rad, dude. That's so cool. Alright, we're gonna do Oxide, and then we're gonna do a time trial with, like, Fate Crash, I guess. And we're gonna see if we break the fucking game. Well! Well! PC port means that a cup of a day track mania thing could be real. Absolutely. The, the thing that you've got to remember with the PC port is like once it's a thing and once a custom track editor is a thing, the only limit is your imagination. Like th this was three years ago or like two years ago. And like we we've come a long way since then. Like a long way. But this was already possible back then. Someone made Splatoon in CTR. Like the, the mini turbo meter became how much paint you had. And they made Splatoon. Like they made Splatoon. They did that. That's a the thing they did. Like. And that was like two and a half years ago people were doing that. And so, you could absolutely do something like that, but that seems way more plausible. Yeah, Cup of a Day in CTR would be insane. That would be fucking awesome. Absolutely, Zerk. Again, no reason why that can't happen. Only reason it can't happen is if your imagination doesn't let it happen. And you've thought of it, so you could... You could bring it up and suggest it, and people can make that. Absolutely. Can we have Fortnite in CTR? No. That's where your imagination should have stopped. It should have stopped right there. You thought too much. You thought too much, and you should have stopped. You should have stopped thinking. You should have. You, you should have. <laughs> you should have put it in reverse tear, and you should have not said that. That was too far. You fucked up. You've, you've sent us back five years. Uh, you fucked it. It's over. 
<laughs> Can we make Rocket League CTR? That's actually cold. I want Dingo to go see! That's what I want. Uh, anyways. Guys, I got a 53 with saving the game three times and uh, among other things. Hoggers. Oh, and with uh, PS1 loads as well. On a build that's 73% complete. Cold Palmer. GG's, man. Aye. Um, so, Adventure Mode works, like, fully on this build. Adventure Mode fully works. That's amazing. Um, that's incredible. Does the final cutscene work? Because, you know... Wow. That's sick. That's so, that's so cool. And does the credits work? And... And the credits seem to work too. The effect even works. That's amazing. Cool. Alright, um... I'm not done yet. I'm gonna reboot the game though. I'm gonna reboot the game. That is something I am gonna do. Uh, do, 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 do. Gonna reboot the game. Gonna do the thing. Uh, do, do, do. And then we're, what we're gonna do is we're gonna do a time trial. And we're gonna see if it breaks everything or not. Hopefully not. But we'll see. Um, hopefully it doesn't break literally everything. Hopefully. Um, okay. What's um? What what what's the fake crash cheat code, please? Um, to game facts and beyond. Um, let's have a look. Game facts. Um, unlock fake crash. Here we go. I've got what I want. But what I need in my life. Circle, down, down, up. Circle, circle, down, left, right. Cheat codes work on this as well. Okay, so I was told that... Um, doing time trials with characters that were not in the original eight, the cast of original eight, um, used to make the game shit itself on this build so we're gonna go to like the most you know memory problematic track oxide station and i'm gonna play as fake crash and we're gonna see if it works well it works here Blizzard Bluff is a good one because of the ice reflections. I'll, I'll do that real quick. Yeah, let me do that as well. Shit. Wow. That shows that y'all have come a long way as well. Jeez. Oops, that's not Bluff, sir. And let's see if ice reflections work. Yeah, and I guess I'll, I'll finish a time trial to see if, if Entropy... And Oxide crash the ship. If they fuck them up. But no, this is working. This is working great. This is great. The, you, you're getting the rare Hypno Shark fake crash gameplay right now, by the way. So watch it. Drink it in. I swear you'll never see anything like this ever again. No. What the fuck was that noise? You're right there, mate. Oh, fuck you. <laughs> My boy in the decom. Lovely. You kind of fast with Fate Crash. Maybe switch forever. Mm, yeah, man. 25.80. Mm, that's fast. Mm. Mm, 24 lap. Sorry, 25 lap. Mm, that's good. Mm, injected. 
Lovely. Yeah, let's see if uh, let's let's see if Entropy appears. Let's see if Bro shows up, and if uh, Bro wants to work. Spell W E R K work work. But yeah, the ice reflections work great. Well, let's see if you can beat my fastest time on this track. Seems to work. Ah, right, does he show up? Yep, there's there's the guy. Oh, baby, go! There's the guy. I get the feeling Oxide's gonna work. Look, there he is. In all his glory. Him. Slow ass. <laughs> Slow ass. Got him. Yo, cheers, DJ. Slow ass. Echo can't even keep up with fake crash. Dumb ass stupid hit. Fuck, he's winning. No. I'm the slow ass. No. Alright, uh, time to game Aline. I'd see you, bitch. I'm afraid to say, um, see ya. Decomp is not done. Uh, that, that was not the announcement. The day that the decomp is done, the PC port is, like, borderline done. That's gonna be a momentous day. Um, it's at 73%, and the main announcement here is that some of the people, or, like, basically everyone recently for the last couple months has been working on, um, online support. Um, for CTR and a lot of people now are starting to go back to making the PC port thing and the decomp thing um, So yeah And the decomp is 100% playable Like I, I can barely I, I can't tell the difference Doubt you can beat that And then oxide's gonna appear right it's not gonna break anything Wow yeah so that they completely fixed this problem from last time unbelievable but yeah, exciting times, dude. Exciting times. And yeah, just to prove that, uh... Ice physics... Like, the reflection on the ice is there and it works and it's great. Doesn't glitch out or anything. Looks terrific. Yeah. Freaking awesome. Good stuff, dude. No wheels, but that's what happens in OG. Yeah, that's the same. Isn't that because the wheels are a texture? They're not actually a, um... A, what's it called? They're not part of the car. Yeah, that's a funny little, like, thing that happens in OG as well, yeah. But yeah. Um... Yeah, not bad, dude. Not bad at all. Good stuff. And finally, let's see if we can end the right way. By the right way, I mean getting the demo to appear and crashing the game. Go, baby, go! Right, I see Fusion. Damn. Yeah, but they fixed a lot of stuff here. Um, and yeah, as I say, we're only 27% of the way. It's crazy to think that, like, I'm pretty sure earlier this year we were at, like, 30. <laughs> like, I think we were at, like, 30% at one point. Or, like, certainly at, like, 50. Um... So, yeah, I mean, they're just, they're, they're, they're cooking. And hopefully now that, like, some of the um, modders have, like, gone from making online stuff to this again, hopefully, um, yeah, we'll be in a good spot. Um, so, yeah. But, yeah, even the demo looks like it's working. Until then. <laughs> There you go. <laughs> There's proof that it's not 100% complete. <laughs> There's proof. There's proof. There's your proof. Uh, that's very funny. That's a good way to end it. But yeah, um, this is awesome. And it's come a hell of a long way. And the fact that a lot of people will be coming back to work on this more rather than online. Yeah, hopefully we'll get the PC port. Um, or the decomp at least, and then the PC port. Do, do, do. But yeah, it's, uh, it's good stuff, man. It's good stuff.